Crochet techniques. The five double crochet cluster stitch. Left handed. To download a guide with our five favorite tips to improve your crochet skills right now, visit newstitchaday.com slash five crochet tips. For this tutorial, you'll need the following materials. A crochet hook and a ball of yarn. A special thanks to our sponsor Lion Brand for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Lion's Pride Wool Spun, available exclusively at Michael's Craft Stores and lionbrand.com. In the color, Oxford Gray. The five double crochet cluster stitch is a uh, what would be considered a bobble technique. Um, it creates these this clustered bunch um, that has sort of a spherical uh, texture on your fabric. So you'll encounter this from time to time in a project, um, and. In this situation, the cluster stitch is made with five double crochets. Um, that's not always going to be the case. You can make a cluster with as little as three stitches, uh, but we're going to show you specifically how to do a five double crochet cluster stitch. So to do that, we are going to uh, begin with step one by yarning over our hook, and then we're going to insert our hook into the next stitch, yarn over and draw through and then we are going to yarn over and draw through two. All right, now we're gonna have two loops on our hook. I know I started with step one and we went through a whole bunch of steps. Um, so I'm just gonna continue working without going step by step and then when we do this again, I'll, I'll run through the steps. So we're gonna do this again. We're gonna yarn over, insert our hook, yarn over and draw through. Then we'll yarn over and draw through two more and we're going to stop there. Okay, so we're not going to finish off the entire double crochet in on each of these, all right? And that's going to add a loop each time. So right now we've got three loops. We've got two double crochets that we've finished the first part of. So we'll do that again. And again, we're just going to go through those first two loops. Now we have four loops on our hook, three double crochets that we've worked the first part of. We're going to do two more double crochets. So yarn over and draw through two. Okay, there's five loops on our hook. And this is the last one. All right, so when we've done the five double crochets, we've worked the first part of, we've got six loops on our hook. We're going to yarn over and draw through all six loops at once. We're going to pull that nice and tight and we're going to do a just a chain stitch to lock those down together. All right. So that's how we do a five double crochet cluster. I'm going to do it for you one more time. And again, we'll do this one step by step. So I'm just going to put a double crochet in between these or actually a few double crochets just to space them out a little bit. Make it easier for us to work at least for this demonstration. All right, so step one, yarn over. Step two, we'll insert our hook into the next stitch. We're gonna yarn over and draw through. Step three, we'll yarn over and draw through two. Okay, we've got two loops on our hook. Step four, we'll yarn over. Step five, insert our hook back through, yarn over and draw through. Okay, step six, we're gonna yarn over and draw through two. Okay, that's got three loops on our hook. Step seven, we'll yarn over. Step eight, we'll insert, yarn over and draw through. Step nine, we'll draw through two after we yarn over. And now we've got four loops on our hook. For step 10, we'll yarn over. Step 11, insert, yarn over and draw through. Step 12, we'll yarn over and draw through two. Okay. So now we have five loops on our hook. That's four of these double crochets, and we are on to step 13, which is to yarn over. Step 14, we'll insert, yarn over and draw through. Step 15, yarn over and draw through two, and that gives us six loops on our hook. 
I believe that was step 16, so we're on 17, which we'll yarn over and draw through all six loops at once. And we'll finish up step 18 by doing a chain stitch to lock those all in place. Okay, and I like to kind of just push and scrunch these up together to give us that nice bobble texture. All right, so that's how we make a five double crochet cluster stitch. Hey, I'm Johnny Vasquez, founder of New Stitch A Day and your teacher for this tutorial. I want to thank you so much for taking the time to learn from us. If you'd like to see more videos just like this, we produce new content every single day. Hence, New Stitch A Day. You can click the subscribe button so that you don't miss a single stitch. And if you click one of the links to the side here, you can see the previous stitch in our series or the next stitch in our series. And if you click this link, you'll be able to see one of my favorites. And don't forget, you can also download a PDF with the written instructions for this tutorial by clicking or using the URL link that's on the screen. Again, I wanna thank you so much for learning with us and I hope that we've helped make your knitting and crochet skills a little bit better today. Yarn on.